Welcome back guys and in this lesson I am going to demonstrate you that how you can work with master documents. So first of all you have to recall that in one of our previous lessons I show you show you how to use the outline view of your document so you can create outlines before writing the text or in other words you can create all the headings that you want in your article and then write text inside those articles. So first we need to navigate to that portion where that or the section where that outline view was so that outline view was present in our ribbon in our view tab and in the views section right over here so here is our outline view so I need to go to outline view first before working with master documents so let's click outline view and okay great now once I'm on my outline view over here just to recall I can select the headings levels that I want to work with and then I also can select which level I want to see right now so let's select all levels over here and the next section the second section in outlining is the master document section so this is what basically I'm going to show you today in this lesson so let's click show document over here and it gives us a couple of options and many of those options are blurred but what are those options the first one is create a sub document the second one is remove a sub document or insert a sub document the third one is unlink a sub document or remove a sub document the fourth one is merge sub documents together the fourth one is split paragraphs between those sub documents and the sixth one is lock document once you've created and done with all the documents sub documents in your word document so now and let's insert some documents into this master document that we will create so let's go to desktop over here and let's insert the revised document first and insert another document the sample document over here so it says sub document sample document the docs cannot be inserted because it is the current master document or because it contains the current master document as a sub document so this means that the sample document is already a master document and we not we cannot insert it into this as a sub document because it is being given the role of a sub document so let's click OK and insert this field code over here. Great. So now we have two documents over here. So to create a sub document, we can click this. Let's create it for now. For example, types of countries. And inside this, we can write all the types of countries. For example, Russia. United States, Pakistan, India, and so on. Great. Now, once you're done with this, so we have three sub documents inside our master document. And then we have now worked with two of our options over here, which are create a sub document. We've created a sub document right over here we've inserted these two documents and now we have to work with unlink or remove sub document so to unlink a document I simply need to select this and click unlink and once I click unlink it will remove this from here so this is what unlink is all about similarly I can split these documents for example let's select this and I want to split this into two sub documents so let's click split over here and you see that I have another sub document created and the text is being splitted now and the last option merge sub document is merge sub documents merge simple documents into a single document so let's highlight this or let's click over here and if I need to merge this I need to select all of this and simply click merge right over here to merge these two documents. So now if I click 
double click over here word will open me a new document which contains only this sub document which is right over here so let's close this over here okay great and now let's work with lock the document now once you're done with all of this you need to lock your document and it says the master document needs to be saved please save it now and try the operation again so let's click OK over here let's save this and now let's click log document so it first gives us the save over here let's give it a name master document press enter go back and now click log document and it says word is saving the revised document let it save and once word is saved this document over here to lock this you need to go to the sub document which you need to lock and simply click lock and you see that there's a sign a lock sign right next to the sub document on the top left corner which means that the document is successfully locked so this is how you can create your master document now the sample document has been is or is created as the master document and it contains all of these sub documents which has the revised document the field codes and the also the types of countries so all these sub content sub documents merged into this document to create a master document which is named sample document now let's close the outline view and you can see that we have all of these sub documents merged within a simple single word document so i hope you learned i hope you enjoyed stay tuned stay focused keep practicing and let's move to our next lesson